Heavenly Father, please help us. Firefighters and rescue workers were overwhelmed with 911 calls as the fire surrounded people in their homes and cars trying to escape. Elderly, needs help. Right now, it's not looking good for us. Uh... As you saw from the opening shots, today I'm going to be hiking through uh, most of Malibu in the uh, Mulholland Snake area to see exactly how much damage was caused by the currently still burning California wildfires. Um, to start things off, check out my view right now. So just yesterday they actually um, lifted the evacuations for the Malibu area in regards to the Woolsey fire. That means that People a week later are now finding out whether or not their homes were burned down and me just driving through the area I could see people pulling up to their homes getting out you know I, I'm assuming they were the owners because there's nobody else there and just seeing the reactions just was awful now to make matters even worse reports of a rainstorm coming through northern and southern California will be happening during the time that this video goes live. Not only does it make it extremely difficult for search and rescue teams to locate the victims from these fires, but it also is a huge problem for landslides and mudslides because none of this debris that is typically here is there to hold back any of the mud or the land that is moving down the mountains. Sorry? Slight intermission. I have to find a different place because they're asking me to leave. I guess they don't want me filming here. I'm willing to respect it, no problem. So I was just asked to leave, but I was just on Mulholland. For those of you that don't know, that's in Malibu, California, where the Woolsey fire destroyed more than 1,500 buildings and killed three people. And on the other side of the 101 freeway is where the Hill Fire burned through Oak Park and Thousand Oaks just one day after the mass shooting that happened at Borderline. Now the worst of the fires is actually up in Northern California where the fire known as the Camp Fire has burned so many buildings, so many structures, so many homes, and it's killed 79 people and leaving 700 people still unaccounted for. The air quality is so bad up north that people are running out of masks to, to give to the people that are affected by the fire. It's just, it's so sad. I wasn't originally gonna create a video like this because I think it's an emotional subject for a lot of people. However, because we built such a great community, I think it's extremely important to be able to use our voice to, to do some good. So I actually teamed up with logo designer David Hugh to design this t-shirt here and 100% of those funds will be donated directly to the California Community Foundation, which will benefit the families affected by these wildfires. This bridge completely melted because of the fire. Let's take a closer look. I apologize for the noise. And I don't know if you guys can see this. This right here, this fire is still smoldering. Can you even imagine how hot that fire must have been in order to melt an entire bridge? This looks like an earthquake hit here. 